get that Hydra. Okay, <clears throat> welcome back. Last episode, we made it all the way to the Hydra, whereupon I said that, oh, the Hydra's the easiest boss, and then I got walloped by it. Uh. Shades of the dead mill constantly within the house, complaining of their woes and seeking audience from any who would listen. I listen. Good. Speaking of listening, let's listen to these guys. Appreciate your patience. What have I done to deserve this? Cause of death, overindulgence. I wonder what that noise was then, but it's huh. it's hi it's Hydra? It's Hypnos. Cowee, looks like the bone Hydra of Asphodel just stomped you that time, huh? I hear each of its heads has its own nasty tricks. That must be tough. Yeah, the one that I was facing just sort of like took its face and just slammed itself against me numerous times. It was unpleasant, yes. Uh, but I do have oh. another... <laughs> I do have another gift to give. I will, of course, give it to my lovely daddy. No, 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 no. My good boy gets the gift. Look what I got for you, boy. He wasn't here last time. As one of Cerberus's heads receives the prince's gift, another muzzles something back into his hand. Oh. Thank you, boy. An old spiked collar. The Cerberus, the fierce and multi-headed hound of hell, is really not so bad as his deserved reputation otherwise would lead you to believe. Aw, oh, of course not. You keep an eye on father for me, boy. Don't let him sour up everyone's mood. <laughs> Cerberus promises to do exactly that in his own way. And of course, we also need to pet the boy. I pet your other heads, huh? No. Boy needs his petting. Good, good Cerberus. Okay, so is Achilles here? Achilles, is it really true that Cerberus ripped the lounge up right after I left? He must have gotten in a lot of trouble. Oh yeah, I completely forgot that happened. I only wish you could have seen it, lad. The place looked like a vineyard after a typhoon. Your Lord Father was livid, but he never gets so angry with the dog. Poor Dusa, though, she's picking the place up. Oh no. I wonder what became of Dusa. She's always worried father's going to fire her, even without something like this. So yeah, it's... It's a smart way of um, keeping things closed off and then opening it up slightly. Is that the dog went on a rampage, even though you never see him do that ever again. Father, what happened to the lounge? The only place for anyone to have a little fun around here and you seal it shut. Oh, I had little choice about that boy. You see, after you fled the first time, Cerberus, why, he was very much upset. Utterly tore the place to shreds. It's now under repair. All thanks to you. You're welcome. You're really blaming me for not minding the dog while I was out and while you all were here. Yes. I lay the blame entirely upon you. Of course he will. Yes. Who else? It's fortunate that Cerberus has calmed himself since then. Come to his senses, I should say. May you yet come to yours. That's never going to happen, Daddy-O. Okay, so we did pick up some gemstones during our last run, so we can renovate. What's that there? The Something from the face. The question is, should we? I always like going for the Fates list, list of Minor Prophecies, because it it gives you an opportunity to like do tasks and those tasks will also give you like gems and diamonds and darkness and stuff like that so I might hold off although I might go for the plunder ooh underworld renovation chambers may contain an infernal trove now we'll keep we'll keep our gemstones until we get 20 and then we'll see about that no nicks wonder where nicks went oh but there is meg hey meg what are your sisters up to these days meg i've not seen them around. oh we we beat meg and now we're talking about her sisters who she doesn't like we're stretched a little thin as you can see some kind of war up there meant lots of business here i'm left to hold the line and deal with you oh you love it though don't you 
Anyway, time to go. <laughs> Anything here? Nope. So we'll see if we can upgrade. Um, let us upgrade our Shadow Presence, which gives us bonus attack and special damage when striking foes from behind. And we'll also do the one death defiance because it's only 30 darkness. And that way we can maybe unlock some more stuff next time. We'll have to see. Uh, but it does mean that with that um, keepsake, we now have two death defiances. So that could be good. But we could also... Excellent. Swap over to the one that Cerberus gave us, which adds hearts to us. So we get 25 extra hearts. So we start with 75 instead of 50. But when you use them, they rank up. So in six, in six encounters, the Lucky Tooth will rank up, which I believe will restore more hearts when the life total is depleted. So we might keep that, keep it to at least rank two and then maybe change the next run we do oh we're gonna try it let's go coronaut we are and i think i'm gonna actually gonna unlock this as well let's see what's in here just so next time we'll get these what you get what you and we get? can start going towards them which i believe are the fists and the gun <laughs> Okay, so we've got hold to fire, volley, flash. Nope, nope. There we go. Can't get my timing right on there. So now, after beating you up, we're gonna give it, have a little talk. I don't suppose I can talk you into fighting back this time. Not a chance, boyo. I'm paid to take it, not to dish it out. Now give it to me. I already gave it to okay. you. I have enough. No more. Again. Yes, again, again, again. <laughs> Let's see what we get. Dust of air. Mm, Hermes could be useful. We have a brand new guy. This mark, almost like a bat wing. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Yes. Hey, boss, found you. Good. Hermes, at your service. Pleasure. You are the talk of Olympus. Normally I wouldn't get mixed up, but for you, I'll be making an exception. Now come on, we've both got places to be. Hermes, the god of swiftness. He's also the messenger, you can tell, because he's got like a little bag of um, scrolls and stuff. Okay, so we've got some good stuff here. We've got side hustle. Each time you enter a chamber, you gain a bit of wealth. So that means that every chamber we go in, we get 10 gold. So that could build up. Um, we've got greater haste. You move faster. And quick reload. Foes drop um, your blood. Is it blood? Bloodstone. That's stuck even faster. Um, I don't think we'll do that one because we only have one bloodstone. So it's either should we move faster? Or should we try and get a bit of extra money? Maybe we can buy some stuff. Yeah, let's try that. The lift, Lord Hermes, Especially the right skill. at the start, it's a perfect time to do it. Oh, let's actually aim for them. There we go. What's that say? The heart seeking bow. Coronach, the so called heart seeker, is certainly the finest bow ever conceived. And wielded once by none other than Mistress Hera, who stood side by side with Zeus on better terms back then, as they drove back the Titans under a storm of arrows and thunder. And when the shield of chaos was shattered, yet a burning effigy remains, its power still intact. A power sealed within the visage of a monstrous entity, even the Titans feared. Okay. Yeah, we got we got twenty now. We've doubled our profits already. Oh, 
can be it can be so nice using the uh, the arrow. It's when the bow and arrow. It's when things get close to you that you sort of like go away, go away, please. There we go. I was like, oh no, it's going to hit me. Let's go with gemstones. We still need darkness, but we want to boost up to uh, to 20. Oh, I knew that was coming, but I didn't, I didn't even attempt to dodge it. What a fool I am. I was trying to be, I was trying to be good. I was trying to be, um, Tricky. <laughs> Trying to do a trick shot. A wretched lout. A lout? Yeah, a wretched lout. There is ample room in Tartarus even for these prodigious Boris entities who doubtless were intolerable even when they lived. I do not doubt that whatsoever. Now, having been reduced to their most base of ne negative impulses, these demable wretches do their part to uphold the underworld's cool reputation. They suck, okay? Ooh, okay. So should we go for damage? Or should we go for crits? I feel, seeing as we've got the arrow, we should go for the bow master, the bow mistress. Sometimes they'll, um, they'll talk about your weapon. So she might talk about a weapon because it's the bow. You're late. No, not you. Ow. Ow. to hit you but I guess that works too okay there was no shop or anything so you seem particularly light on your feet there Zagreus I'd figure Hermes himself was speeding you along except I've not seen him about in been a while really oh well, that's funny you should say something so because he uh, Hermes was the first but god he beat you all to the punch this time Okay, so your attack is stronger with a 15% chance to deal critical damage. Let's do that one, yeah. That's how I've been doing it anyway, so yep. Let's go get a key. I think the next few weapons need about 8 keys, so we definitely need a lot. These guys are usually so easy to fight, but like with so many of them, you don't want them to gang up on you because they will just punch you. I can use that back home. Yes, my thingy has upgraded. So if we have a look, now I it automatically restores seventy five hearts when I deplete my stuff. So that's good. Some of Charon's wares. Um. Uh, let's leave it for now. Like I say, I never like using them. Let's see. Let's see what Aphrodite has to offer us. Let us fight this thing. Oh, not this one. I don't like. I don't like this one. They just... And they... Uh, every so often I do get hit by the... Uh, 
the lions, but I'm doing pretty well this time. Although I shouldn't say that while I'm still fighting. Because then it just means that, oops, I die. <laughs> I did actually Let's pretty well. Crystal, then. Usually, usually it points that laser straight at you when it does like a lot of them. And for some reason it didn't this time. Thing or two about that one. Though lately we Olympians no longer mingle with those living in the underworld. You're the only oh. exception. Does that imply what I are you implying what I think you're implying there? I don't think you are. Okay, so your special deals more damage and inflicts weak. Your dash deals more damage when you end up where you end up inflicting weak, or any heart chamber rewards are worth more. Uh, we've not uh, do I want to dash? We're going to go with the special. So oh, then all of those are just like Damned lost weak. souls with nowhere left to turn congregate in deepest Tartarus where they fuse together with the earth itself into odious forms which defy description. They basically turn into big crystals. Yes, yes they do. Big, big crystals that we beat the crap out of. An angle right. Ow. There we go. They did more damage than that big one did. Ooh. I would have gone for the gold, but a Daedalus Hammer is always the best bet. Ow. Ooh, okay. Okay. So your special fires four shots. Your attack deals up to three foes. And your power shot is easier and deals 150% damage. Let's go for the power shot, the perfect shot. So now I can tell easily when to attack. God damn little heads, little shits. Okay, okay, okay. There we go. <laughs> just that one, just having the time of his life, just having fun. Ooh, is that the first? Oh, and obviously we also get gemstones here, so let's go for it. Um, yeah, we'll heal ourselves a little bit as well. Is this the first time we've come across this guy? I can't remember. I think it might be. So, like, every area you get to meet, you get an exclamation point, and you get a character that you can talk to. So, in Tartarus, it is this guy. Hey, Princess. Must look like I'm slacking off with the old boulder here, but... I was just getting back on my feet. The Fury Sisters don't often leave me be. Where'd they go, anyway? And, um, what are you doing here? So this is Sisyphus, and he is a tortured soul. And the best part about meeting these guys is that they always give you something. Oh, well, you know, just out on a little stroll is all. Do me a favour, though. You see the Fury Sisters. Let them know I was headed down the way I came from, will you? Oh, I'll let them know, all right. I hear you loud and clear, Your Highness. 
I'll just go about my business now and you take care. Same to you, Sisyphus. So for Sisyphus, his benefits are you can heal, you can get some darkness, and you can get some gold. Uh, I'm going to go with the darkness because it's always good. And it gets you like, I think it's around 50, 40 to 50. Say no more. Which, because we've Six got three. the boosted weapon means 66 nice so excellent although it would have been nice to have gone for gold and then gone to a gold chamber as well same to you and obviously there'll be somebody in um asphodel and there'll be somebody in the other ones as well in the last area but I'll leave that for surprise for when we uh, encounter them. I don't remember whether it's, um, dude. You want to go? What was I saying? I don't know whether it's only one encounter out of all of them on a run, or whether it's just one encounter of each of them. So like now that we've seen Sisyphus, we might not be able to meet any of the others on this one. But I also could be wrong about that, we'll find out. Coin from the dead. Oh. I would love the coin from, from the dead. And I would now love to spend the coin from the dead. How are you doing, Caron? I've got to say, you are a sight for sore eyes there, Caron. Mm. So, uh, looks like you're selling, is that it? You come to help me out? Take that as a yes. So we're gonna go for the darkness, because we always like darkness. And we're gonna go for the Dionysus boom. Hey, what's uh, with that K Ron man? He's sort of I don't know, though I am glad he's been of service. Yeah, me too. Ooh, using the fountain, strong drink, restores all hearts and gives you a bonus damage. That is nice, but we've not put in any of the fountains throughout any of the areas, so we will go this time for Drunken Dash. Cheers to that. Oh, I thought we had enough coins to buy everything, but we didn't. So we'll just continue now. Let's see if we can beat Meg for the third time with the third weapon. Oh, hello. <laughs> that was stubborn, Arkeo. Maybe my whip might make you reconsider whatever it is that you're attempting here. Your whip's not been all that persuasive in the past. Ooh. Nasty. Maybe persistence will pay off for both of us. Come then. Let's see, I'm, I'm not sure how we're going to do on this one. We want to zoom around her. Give a bit of um, drunkenness. Ow, I didn't see her because he was in front of that guy. It's just damage over time, but it, it adds up, so. <laughs> What did you do with the gem? Do, oh, I have it. Oh, yeah, because you were invulnerable last, when you got it out of you. I was like, where is it? Let's get a bit out of here, because I think that's the one where she... Oh, no. I thought that was the one where she started spitting, like them all out, all the little balls. Yeah, there are the balls. Oh, I got a bit too close to her then. A bit too uh, comfortable. 
Why out of everybody were you aiming for the little creature next to her? Okay, that wasn't as tense as it was the last time, but I think I'm getting comfortable fighting Meg now. But sometimes she'll just she'll just mess you up if you're not prepared. We've got three Titan blood now, that's excellent. Proceed. Got a little bit more health as well. Don't mind me, father. So you can you can get a thingy, an upgrade, which I think costs ten gemstones to get um your keepsake box, so you can change it around if you want to. Depends which keepsake you uh you pick up. To be honest, uh, nah. I considered getting the upgraded rarity one, but. Changed, decided not to. Love that sulfur smell. I love that clinking sound, which means that I get even more gold. Let's go get some keys. Now, we defeat these guys, these witches. <laughs> I completely destroyed the ones that were coming for me and just dashed into the ones that weren't. I was like, no, wait. Say, oh, that was easy, but I did get hurt a little bit there, so maybe not as easy as I was making it out to be. Oh, we'll go for some more gemstones. We've here. got enough to get the table, so let's see if we can get one of the other upgrades as well. Too many of you. Don't mean to be rude, but piss off, please. Oh, that was nice. Three and one was beautiful. Ooh, we'll need to get another heart. We've only got 75 health. We'll save our gold for a little bit longer. Oh yeah, I forgot you can also backstab. I should attempt to do that more. Ow, that hurt, asshole. really want them that close to me and then I death right into them Let's deal some death. okay there's a thingy over there Ugh. Do that. Now I've got 75 out of 100. Uh, let's, let's try the Eye of the Lamia. Slain foes have a 15% chance to drop hearts in the next three account encounters. So hopefully we'll get a bit of a boost. Let's go get some more Artemis boons. Oh. Okay, 
Why are you dude? Oh, you jumped on the fire. What a fool you are. Ah. Ow. He packed. He packed a punch. Until next time, gigantic Gorgon head. Okay, we've got a gift. We could maybe give it to Artemis. Maybe. In the name of Hades. I pressed the wrong button anyway, so we're not. Okay, so any damage you deal has a chance to be critical. That's four percent. And after you deal critical damage to a foe. A foe near it is marked. So marked means that they have a higher chance of taking a critical. Uh, let's go with that one then. Let's see if we can get some darkness. Because, ouch, did they pack a punch? Uh, where are you guys? Guys. Hello. Slam dances. That was nice. They didn't die in sync, but close enough. So not fair to be just like all the way up there. Oh, I had that health. Thank you. All mine. Some more. Oh, you also see these ones, which is where you can sell your boons basically for money, which we don't want to do. Well, you could if you had the opportunity, if you wanted to. Okay. I thought I saw a shop, but I guess I didn't. I guess I'm just stupid. Um, okay, so I don't want to go to see Zeus because I don't think we've got anything that can help him. I kind of want to get some more cash. It sounds weird, I know. We're going to risk it. Going to regret it instantly, but that's what we're doing, okay? completely. I've got him that time though. There we go. Oh, I got some health. Ow. Got some health there as well. What was I doing there? What the fuck was that? But we got... We got 138 for that one, so that's good. So we're gonna go spend that money instant, instantly. Instantly? What the hell does that mean? So yeah, we're gonna see if we can get the rematch to the Hydra. Oh, that's weird that there's no, um, I was paying for health, but I guess not. Of the gods. So we will, we will increase our attack. But a blessing. And we're gonna, yeah, let's go for Zeus. Come on. Of the underworld has found the means to reach you with my blessing, nephew. Such strange alliances we forge these days. Yeah. So your cast is a burst chain lightning that bounces between foes. After you dash just before getting hit, a bolt strikes a nearby foe. 
We're going to go for Heaven's Vengeance, which is after you take damage, your foe is struck by lightning. So hopefully that'll... If the, if the Hydra does attack and kill us this time, we will make it pay. We will make it suffer for doing so. Remember me? Yeah, dude, you remember me? Oh, I wasn't even that. Just power shot in and trying to avoid it chucking stuff at me. Oh, I didn't even attempt to dodge that and I thought I was gonna like get hit. I was like, there's no way I'm in, in range for that. Oh shit. Oh, I don't know why I'm so worried. I have another two lives. I'm so like, oh no, I might die in this one. Like you just stand and take them. I'm surprised. I'm not surprised I beat it. I am surprised that I did it without actually losing a life. So we've done that, and then we get a diamond. I'll just take that. Battled out of Asphodel with the heart seeking bow. So we make it to the next level one. That's how much health I got. I got 20 health. That's ridiculous. <laughs> we definitely need a bit more, so let's get up to halfway. There we go. I can feel like I can breathe a little bit more now. It is the furthest we've come. And we are now here. In Asphodel. Asphodel? In Elysium, thank you. A moment. Sorry about that. I had to go blow my nose. Not that you guys really care about that. I don't know. I had to go in. Well, it wasn't really going into detail, Rare, but still. Of Elysium, reserved for only the most great of mortal souls, spread forth luxuriantly all about the fire-stepping prince. Cool. Luxuriantly, Elys really. Elysium is the prettiest place. I just need to storm my way through that eternal paradise. But I absolutely loathe the uh, the enemies in this place. They're my least favourite, including the last boss. No, let me rephrase that. I like the last boss. They suck to fight. That's all I'm going to tell you until and unless we make it there. They've got this thing where, where you fight them and then they turn into those little ones. Not all of them. 
And then if you don't defeat the little one after enough time has passed, then it's just it's just a um they turn back into the old one again. And it's like, no thank you. That's not good, that's not nice. Well, we're going to go for another Daedalus Hammer. Let's see if we can improve our lot even more. Chariot. I think that other chariot may have destroyed itself. Keep being closer, dude. Butterflies suck as well. It's just not a friendly place. I should get this bow back into tip top shape. Okay, so charge volley, hold special for up to 200% base damage. Uh, your attack deals 150 damage to nearby foes. And your special pierces bows and deals 400% to armor. We're going to go for the piercing volley. You always want something work. that'll deal with uh, with armor. I just need to remember that that will. Uh, let's go for Hermes. Let's see if he's got anything else to offer us. Great shields. Yeah, these are the guys that are just the worst. You can't fight them in when they're in front, they're impervious to damage. The, uh, I, I see him. We got the arm away from them. I couldn't speak then. I was like, we've got something. Okay. So, hyper sprint, after you dash, you briefly come, become sturdy and move 100% faster. And I think we're going to go for that one. It helps us get out of dodge. But it tries to help us get out of dodge. Ooh. We're not close to the thingy yet, so should we go for another? Yeah, let's go for another one. Another nectar. More trouble. Sometimes it does pay. Because there's always. There's always a shop at the end of the level. And sometimes you can get a shop not at the end, like halfway through. And sometimes it does pay to go through the middle one. Because he'll have something that you can steal. And that can sometimes be useful to do. Because if you fight him and you win against him, you'll get like... His shop will have a sale, I believe. It's been a while. I could be wrong. I could also... I should probably also stop talking. Because I'm not very good at talking and fighting at the same time. As you can see by... Uh, my... Uh, oh. You need to go. You need to go. Let's get that one. Okay, we got we got we got one more death defiance left. Perfect. Definitely perfect. Ooh, we've got an automatic boss here. Full of 
Minas. The Bull of Minas. You come from the bowels of hell. This is not your place. The better half of the of the bosses here. Asterius. He's Three awesome. Counts. Just passing through, so you'll excuse me. Yeah, you want us to pass through? If you want us to leave, we'll just leave. I will not. The champion of Elysium would never back down from such a contest. Neither will I. Wait, you're not the champion of Elysium. You're the Bull of Minos. I can't imagine he's even stronger than you. Is it Heracles? Tell me it's Heracles. I will not. You talk too much, short one. Come get destroyed. But he's also the worst person to be fighting against. Because he just zooms right into ya. Oh. I'm not aiming right, I'm trying to get it at the right time. Oh. <gasps> well fought. Thank you. Speak pales in comparison to that of the champion of Elysium. I expect you'll soon see for yourself. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'm getting past him today. I beat the bull of Minos. I did. Barely. Barely, my boy. We've got Dionysus here. Dad by now, your Uncle Zeus. He's cool and loves a feasting. Just be sure to keep him in your thoughts, okay? Yeah, we don't want him to get angry at us, do we? Okay, let's go for... Ironically, we're going to go for the rare one. Your hangover effects make foes more, move slower. So we'll zoom past them and then they'll be very slow. So we have no more death defiances. But we're gonna continue on. Oh, these guys suck as well. They explode when you get near, so you've gotta sort of just like do it so that they slam into the walls and stuff. It's fun. Now we can deal with these guys. How do I nicely say I don't give a shit about all of you? There we go. Good for the health. Yeah, we're at 125. But we only have 55 health. Can I buy some health? No, but we also have an Isle of Amia, so we'll do that again. And we're going to attempt to boost one of our boons. Don't really need any more, to be honest. Okay, so let's get this one. Let's move to this one, who was just happy as a clam to just... Uh, oh, I hoped he'd get caught in it, but no. He was just patiently waiting, you know? Oh, jeez, really? It came back and he was still just like out of reach. Okay, 
that hurt, but at least it gave me a bit of um, vengeance damage from Zeus. Pommel power. I don't know why I looked for that. Uh, let's increase our vengeance damage from 148 to 212. Powered up. Oh, I missed past that. Um, is that a hammer? Or is that a gem? I can't really tell by the colour. I think it might be a gem. Let's go for it. Although those keys were a boss, it would have given me double. How are you guys hurting me so much? didn't make it and there I go sinking into the blood but uh, I'm definitely getting I'm getting better although that does mean that I seem to be doing only um, one running episode so I might try well I'm doing more episodes a week now because this one should be coming up on I've been doing them Thursdays so this episode should come out on Saturday no, Wednesdays. I've been putting them out on Wednesdays. So now I'm probably going to be doing it three times a week, maybe two times a week, depending on if I'm... I don't know. We'll work it out. And if not, I might uh, next episode do, um, you know, two runs at once. You know, we'll, we'll see. But uh, cause I would, I would... Yeah, we will see, we'll see. Not saying anything else, so uh, I will see you in the next episode. If you, um, geez, I'm all scatterbrain now. I'm like, I really want to play some more, but I don't have the time to. So, uh, yeah, if you liked what you saw, consider subscribing to my channel using the button on the right, and there should be some videos on the left that you can watch if you want to watch more of me. Yeah, your choice, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye.